Another common icon of evolution is the story of the peppered moth. This little guy right here. So this is supposed to show natural selection in action uh, in modern times that we can actually see, not just somewhere back in history where we have to assume it happened. The idea is that you have two colors of moth, and as they live out their lives, one of them is better camouflaged. Uh, it started off the light colored moth was better camouflaged. Then due to pollution and different things, the tree bark changes colors. All the lichen dies and it turns into this dark tree. Now, now the light colored moth is not camouflaged anymore and so he gets eaten and you have more in the population of dark colored moths. Uh, and, and so then the, the, the scientists were very excited about this. They said, oh great, now we, have, we had one kind of moth and now we have another kind of moth. And this shows how in nature, random forces like birds eating them, predators, whatever, random forces can cause a population to shift from light colored to dark colored. The problem with this is, is it's still a moth. You didn't get any new features. You always had both colors the whole time. And in, and in fact, once they clean up pollution, they pass some laws, the trees went back to being light colored. What happened to the moths? They went back to being light colored. There, nothing changed. You didn't get a brand new super moth. And in fact, this only shows how populations can shift back and forth and adapt to their environment and not how we can get a brand new feature.